In this video, I will tell you about the celebrities we lost in 1983. This tribute pays homage to the iconic figures who shaped our culture, from Hollywood legends to music maestros. Karen Carpenter, singer and drummer. Karen Carpenter, famed for her remarkable contralto vocals, soared to fame with her brother Richard in the Carpenters duo. Her drumming skills transitioned to fronting the band, leading to immense success in the 1970s, cementing her legacy as one of the greatest singers of all time. William Demarest, American actor. Carl William Demarest, vaudeville star turned Hollywood legend, captivated audiences with over 140 film appearances, notably in Preston Sturge's screwball comedies and as Uncle Charlie in My Three Sons. From wartime service to a star on the Walk of Fame, his legacy shines brightly. Doodles Weaver, comedian and actor. Doodles Weaver, born into wealth, lit up radio with Spike Jones's City Slickers. He hosted his NBC variety show and starred in films. Known for pranks at Stanford, Weaver's comedy legacy lives on despite his tragic end in 1983. UB Blake, musician and composer. UB Blake, iconic pianist and composer, co-wrote the groundbreaking Broadway musical Shuffle Along in 1921. Hits like I'm Just Wild About Harry defined his career. President Reagan honored him with the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 1981. Arthur Godfrey, radio and television personality. Arthur Godfrey, famed broadcaster, hosted numerous radio and TV shows in the 1950s, but controversy followed. His firing of Julius La Rosa led to public backlash. Despite this, he remained an iconic figure and later advocated against smoking after being diagnosed with lung cancer. Herge, cartoonist. Herge, the Belgian comic artist, revolutionized comics with The Adventures of Tintin. His meticulous drawings and gripping plots captivated audiences worldwide. Despite controversy, his legacy endures, with a museum dedicated to him in Belgium. Tennessee Williams, playwright and author. Tennessee Williams, renowned American playwright, captivated audiences with iconic works like A Streetcar Named Desire and Cat on a Hot Tin Roof. His turbulent family life inspired his masterpieces, earning him a place in the American Theatre Hall of Fame. Gloria Swanson, actress and producer. Gloria Swanson, iconic actress of the silent era, dazzled audiences in classics like Sunset Boulevard. Her career spanned silent films to TV, earning Oscar nominations and a Golden Globe. From a chance encounter at 15 to Hollywood stardom, her journey epitomized Hollywood glamour. Earl Fatha Hines, jazz musician, pianist. Earl Hines, legendary jazz pianist, pioneered modern piano style, influencing greats like Herbie Hancock and Art Tatum. Born in 1903, his unique sound shaped jazz history. Hines's mastery earned praise from icons like Dizzy Gillespie and Errol Garner. Pete Farndon, musician. Gloria Swanson, iconic actress of the silent era, dazzled audiences in classics like Sunset Boulevard. Her career spanned silent films to TV, earning Oscar nominations and a Golden Globe. From a chance encounter at 15 to Hollywood stardom, her journey epitomized Hollywood glamour. Felix Papalardi, musician and producer. Felix Papalardi, a multifaceted musician, co-led Mountain, known for Mississippi Queen. He shaped the sound of Cream's Disraeli Gears and worked with Leslie West, influencing heavy metal's genesis. His legacy reverberates in rock music history. George Balanchine, choreographer. Georgie Balanchine, hailed as the father of American ballet, co-founded the New York City Ballet. His neoclassical style revolutionized choreography, blending influences from imperial ballet with Broadway. He collaborated with Stravinsky and shaped ballet's 20th century landscape. Jack Dempsey, boxer. Jack Dempsey, dubbed the Manassa Mauler, dominated boxing in the 1920s as heavyweight champion from 1919 to 1926. His aggressive style and knockout power made him a legend. Dempsey set records, including boxing's first million dollar gate and pioneered live sports broadcasting. Muddy Waters, musician blues singer. Muddy Waters, the father of modern Chicago blues, rose from Mississippi's Stovall Plantation to revolutionize blues in post-Wadi Pooh America. His classics like Hoochie Coochie Man and I Just Wanna Make Love To You reshaped music, influencing rock and roll. Buckminster Fuller, architect and inventor. R. Buckminster Fuller, a polymathic visionary, revolutionized architecture with inventions like the geodesic dome. His ideas shaped modern thought from spaceship Earth to tensegrity, earning him 28 U.S. patents and prestigious honors, including the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Norma Shearer, actress. Norma Shearer, a trailblazing actress, portrayed bold, liberated characters and won an Oscar for The Divorcee, 1930. Her influence as a feminist icon reshaped Hollywood's portrayal of modern women. Raised in privilege, she defied odds to pursue acting, charming audiences with her talent. Chris Wood, 
musician. Chris Wood, a founding member of Traffic, shaped the band's sound with his flute and saxophone. His musical journey started in Birmingham, where he played with future stars like Steve Winwood and Jim Capaldi. Wood's artistic flair and innovative contributions define Traffic's iconic sound. David Niven British actor, author. David Niven, a British actor, rose to fame in classic Hollywood with his charm. After military service, he pursued acting, starring in classics like Wuthering Heights and The Pink Panther. Niven won an Academy Award and a Golden Globe for separate tables in 1958. Frank Reynolds, journalist and news anchor. Frank Reynolds, an iconic American television journalist, anchored ABC Evening News and co-anchored World News Tonight. He pioneered America Held Hostage, later Nightline, during the Iran hostage crisis. Reynolds served in World War II and received a Purple Heart. Carolyn Jones, American actress. Carolyn Jones, an American actress, rose to fame in the 1950s with an Oscar nomination and Golden Globe recognition. She became iconic as Morticia Adams in The Adams Family. Jones battled severe asthma in childhood, later pursuing acting at the Pasadena Playhouse. Raymond Massey, Canadian actor. Raymond Massey, a Canadian actor with a commanding voice, earned an Oscar nomination for his portrayal of Abe Lincoln. He played Lincoln multiple times and starred in Dr. Kildare. Massey's lineage traced back to the Massey-Harris Tractor Company founders. Ira Gershwin, American lyricist. Ira Gershwin, the renowned American lyricist, collaborated with his brother George Gershwin, crafting iconic songs like I Got Rhythm and Embraceable You. Beyond Broadway, he penned classics with other composers and authored the acclaimed book Lyrics on several occasions. Lynn Fontan, English actress. Lily Fontan, an English actress, married Alfred Lunt, forming the, the Lunts. Renowned for their stylish performances in light comedies and romantic plays, they dazzled audiences on both Broadway and the West End for four decades. Mike Kellen, American actor. Kellen, a talented actor, started on Broadway in 1949. He starred in over 50 plays, earning acclaim and awards. Notably, he appeared in iconic TV shows like Lost in Space in The Twilight Zone, leaving a lasting legacy in film and television. Ninoy Aquino, Filipino politician. Benigno Aquino Jr., a Filipino senator and governor, bravely opposed Marcos's regime, enduring imprisonment. His assassination in 1983 sparked resistance, leading to his wife Corazon's presidency, marking a pivotal moment in Philippine history. Simon Oakland, American actor. Simon Oakland, an American actor, graced screens with memorable roles in Psycho, West Side Story, and Bullet. Born in Brooklyn to immigrant parents, he began as a violinist before transitioning to acting on Broadway and later TV, leaving a lasting legacy in entertainment. Tony Mannix, socialite and Hollywood figure. Camille Bernice Mannix, known as Tony Lanier, captivated Hollywood with her life's drama. She caught attention for her relationship with MGM head Eddie Mannix, then shocked with an affair with George Reeves, the Superman actor. Her life, filled with love and scandal, left a lasting legacy. Earl Tupper, inventor, entrepreneur. Earl Tupper, the creative mind behind Tupperware, revolutionized food storage. Born on a New Hampshire farm, he turned polyethylene slag into iconic containers. Partnering with Brownie Wise, he pioneered home party sales, shaping modern marketing. Tupper's legacy lives on worldwide. The Grand Wizard, Ernie Roth. Wrestling manager, Ernie Roth, AKA the Grand Wizard of Wrestling, dazzled as a manager with his flamboyant style. Starting as a DJ, he entered wrestling, portraying Abdullah Farouk, the villainous manager of the Sheik. A WWE Hall of Famer, he pioneered manager interference in matches. Pat O'Brien, American film actor. Pat O'Brien, Hollywood's Irishman, starred in 100 plus films, often as Irish characters. Memorable roles in Newt Rockney All-American, Angels with Dirty Faces, and Some Like It Hot, often paired with James Cagney, also active on stage and TV. George Liberace, musician. George Liberace, brother of Liberace, was a violinist, arranger, and TV personality. Known for his catchphrase, I wish my brother George was here, managed KMUV-TV and the Liberace Museum. Died in 1983, leaving a legacy in music and entertainment. Merle Travis, musician and songwriter. Merle Travis, born in Rosewood, Kentucky, was a legendary country singer, guitarist, and songwriter. Known for hits like 16 Tons and Dark as a Dungeon, he pioneered Travis picking guitar style, inducted into Nashville songwriters and country music halls of fame. Jessica Savage, journalist. Jessica Savage, an American TV journalist, broke barriers as one of the first women to solo anchor network newscasts. Her captivating presence led her to anchor NBC nightly news weekends and Frontline on PBS. Though criticized for her experience, she was beloved by audiences. 
Tom Evans, English musician. Tom Evans, renowned as the bassist for Badfinger, co-wrote the iconic song Without You. He also sang lead vocals on Come and Get It. Joining the Ivies in 1967, he contributed hits like Maybe Tomorrow. Despite some singles not taking off, their success soared in the UK and beyond. Michael Conrad. Actor Michael Conrad, famed for Sergeant Phil Esterhouse on Hill Street Blues, won two Emmys. He also served in Watch 2. His TV career spanned from Car 54, Where Are You, to Perry Mason in My Favorite Martian. 